Hi guys, welcome back to another video of Ajuvi channel. So today's topic is about local anesthetics. So we have a question and answering section. So why local anesthetics often don't work in infected tissue? So whenever we are going to perform a small surgery or a regional surgery, we will be mainly going for local anesthetics infiltration. So if at all the tissue is very highly infected or affected with any bacteria or any other fungi and whenever the infection state is very high, the local anesthetics won't work properly and they won't attain proper local analgesia. So why this is happening in case of infected tissues? So we have to focus on the word highly infected tissues. So please subscribe this channel and hit the bell icon for more updates. So we are going to see the reason why those local anesthetics won't work in highly infected tissues. So the relevant feature of any infected tissue is that it tends to be more acidic environment than the usual due to production of certain compounds inside the cell and outside the cell the acidity near the infected area will be high. So whenever there is any infection means there will be many problem with the cell metabolism and all. So there will be alterations in the producer production of enzymes and all. So there will be some acidic nature normally. So whenever the infected tissue is due to the etiological agent that is staphylococcus bacteria, pseudomonas bacteria or any other pus forming bacteria or any other gas forming bacteria mainly that acidic environment will be there so we all know that whenever acidic environment is happening at a tissue area the ph will be reduced see the ph will be reduced so what happens the local anesthetic will be ionized the local anesthetic will be ionized Ionized local anesthetic cannot get into the cell and block the sodium channel. So if at all the local anesthetic have to work properly means they have to have a big fraction of unionized local anesthetics. So due to the reduced pH, the fraction of unionized local anesthetic is reduced. That means the amount of local anesthetic that can pass into the cell through the bipolar membrane will be less so that the local anesthetics will not be acting properly and consequently the effect is delayed and reduced. So this is why local anesthetic will not be working on infected tissues because they cannot, the, they cannot cross the cell membrane and get into the cell and block the sodium channel from the inside of the cell. So infected tissue may also have increased blood supply due to the rubber, tuber, calor and all. We have studied all those things. So whenever a tissue is infected, the body will try to prevent that infection and the body will be giving so much blood to that area and try to prevent the inflammation and all. So there will be increased blood supply and hence more anesthetic will be removed from the area. That is clearing those blood so before it can reach the neuron. So more anesthetic cleared will be present due to the increased blood supply. Thank you.